how I get 10 positive replies every single day. Yes, every single day. These are the examples that you, I'm, I'm literally showing you right now, but without sending personalized messages. And I think that's the key to all of this. You know, I'm sure, I'm not too sure about you guys, but I dread having to, you know, send hundreds of personalized messages. It's just mentally exhausting. and I don't want to do it. So I just wanted to figure out a way to actually attract people that might be interested in working with me without hand having to send personalized messages and be in sort of straight to the point at the same time. So I'm getting all these positive replies and I'm sort of qualifying them from the first message. And um, yeah, they're either saying they're interested or they're not because I don't really want to bring people into my network on LinkedIn if they're not really interested in what I do, if that makes sense. Um, that's just for me personally. So, um, like I said, the, the proofs in the pudding, these are examples of people actually replying to me um, throughout last week. So I've got nothing to hide. I've just obviously um, covered their names and just to read you some examples. Hi, Josh, I really like your approach to pitching. Please keep doing it this way. I repeat that again. I really like your approach to pitching. Please keep doing it this way. And if you stay until the end of this video, I'm just literally going to show you the exact script. I've got two scripts that I use. One's probably more effective than the other but both are really good. And yeah, I'm literally gonna show you if you watch to the end of this video. Someone else said to me, hi Joshua, your message was so clear, genuine and intriguing. I couldn't help but respond yes. I would be interested to read your ebook. You know, I mean, people are literally saying like, you know, your pitching is really good. And people, bear in mind, remember, people don't like getting pitched. People don't like getting sold, especially from the first message. And these people are actually saying, I, I love it. You know, I love the way you message me. Your reach out was polite and non-aggressive. So yes, happy to receive your copy of your guide. Hi Josh, I think what you're doing is great idea. Lucky for you, I have some spare time. So I'll give it a yes, another positive reply. And this person just replies um, from my message. I'm not gonna read this all, I'm not gonna read this all, but you get, you know, you get it guys. People are sending me positive replies. I'm gonna show you how to do this without sending personalized messages. It's very long, it's very time consuming and people don't want to do it. I know my, a lot of people are lazy. That's why I'm sort of explaining how to do this. I'm a little bit lazy myself. Maybe I, sh I should be sending more personalized messages, but I mean, you know, the script I'm using is not personalized and it's working. So why, why try and fix something that's not broken essentially? And so it's a simple four step process guys. So as I said, it's a simple four step process. And I'm just gonna to explain to you the steps and the psychology behind it too, because psychology is actually a big thing when you're actually doing these, um, sending these messages too, because you wanna pitch it in a way where you wanna be polite, you wanna try and qualify them, and then you wanna make sure they don't feel pressured to actually um, to answer in you. So step one, you wanna ask them a question. You don't wanna waste your time most importantly, but you also don't want to waste their time at the same time. We don't want to waste each other's time, right? Because if I'm trying to sell you something and you don't want to be sold, then then we shouldn't speak, right? Simple as. So step two, you always want to offer something. You want to offer value. Bring value first, ask for their permission. This is super important. This is not going to work if you don't have anything to offer, anything really good. In order to have something really good, you need to know your market really good. Um, I want to, I want to try and fix the biggest problem that my market is facing and that's you know generating leads they don't know where the next cli client's coming from they don't know you know they don't have a steady flow of um, leads in their pipeline etc so that's the biggest problem and i want to fix that and i want to do it for free so hopefully they actually go and implement what i teach them and then they come back and they say you know josh what else can you help me do and that's you know i, I play i personally play the long game so step three you want to give them something to do however you want to make it simple no effort on their end super important make it nice and simple but no effort we live in a day and age where you know to actually get people to do stuff especially when you're trying to sell them something it's just like it's not happening it's definitely not happening so you want to make it super simple and i forgot to also mention guys when you're actually writing this make sure the copy is nice and um it's like spread it out it's not in like big paragraphs because that's the last thing you want to do i'm sure we've all witnessed that before when someone's messaged you and it's just one big paragraph and you're thinking nope delete straight away that's what i think anyways so you want to sort of make sure you spaced out your copy and it's just easy to read and it's not too long too super important step four take off all the pressure on their end 
take off all the pressure. I mean, you don't have to do this. You might look like someone I could potentially help, but listen, I'm not forcing you to do anything. You don't need to do this. So this is a script. I mean, literally, this is a script. You pause this video and copy the script and just implement it right now and you'll see the success. I guarantee if you message 50 people right now with this script, six, five or six would say yes, definitely. And then out of that five or six, two or three might end up turning into clients, whether you're a coach, consultant, whether you're agency owner, whether you're doing this on LinkedIn, obviously my, my YouTube's primarily on LinkedIn, you know, this is working really well on LinkedIn, whether, you know, you're on Facebook, your prospects on Facebook, whether Instagram, TikTok, email, this works on email too, I've been doing this on email, my VA's been doing this with me on email and this has been working really well, so, um, yeah, I mean, literally, just take this script. So, um, it reads the follow. I, Hey X, curious, are you interested in, and then I would personally say curious, are you interested in, you know, generating more leads on LinkedIn? If so, happy to send you, you know, my free ebook on ways to generate unlimited leads on LinkedIn. If you'd like to check it out, you know, simply reply yes or thumbs up and I can send it over. And if you're, if you're not interested, no worries at all, you know, just start a check. Step one. Ask a question, don't waste their time, don't waste your time. This is the question. Curious, are you interested in generating leads? Step two, offer value, bring value first. Ask for their permission. You know, if you like, check it out, just reply yes or thumbs up and I can send it over. Give them something simple to do. Step four, take off all the pressure on their end. And if you're not interested, no worries at all. Literally, that simple. <laughs> I'm literally saying like, this is this is this simple, guys and you won't have an issue of getting positive replies. And listen, you can't just send 10. You need to do quite a lot of volume because it's not personalized. You need to make sure the volume is a lot. So you can send in maybe 100. You can hire a VA to do this, 100, 200 messages a day. And not with those 200 messages, 100 messages, I mean, you'll get 10, 15 easily of people saying yes. Make sure to send up follow-up messages too. I realize this is also effective if you send follow-up messages too after 24 hours. So make sure you actually actually pop him back in and say, you know, hey, was you still interested, etc. And then this is another one. So this is a different framework you can use. So step one will be an open loop question. Step two, cost of um, inaction. Step three, poke the bear. Step four, detach from the outcome. And you're probably thinking, Joshua, like, what does this mean? Is this even English? Is this even English? And yeah, it is. Let me show you an example. So, so you want to say, hey, first name, I have a bit of an unusual question for you, dot, 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 dot. And they're probably thinking, what do you mean? Well, we've noticed, we've noticed a lot of coaches are struggling to find new clients outside word of mouth, outside, you know, networking events. They're also getting so busy servicing their, you know, existing clients that one day, you know, they lift their head up and realize their referrals have dried up. Was wondering what you're doing to address the challenges, you know, you're facing, you know, in the industry. Happy to share what we found out is working well for other coaches like yourself when it comes to generating leads and adding clients. But first, but first wanted to see if this is something you're open to exploring. This, this works really well too. This is a really clever way to actually pitch someone without pitching someone. I've personally realized that this one's personally working well for me. Um, not trying to say it's going to 100% work for you, but this, this is the one that's working really well for me. This one's working good too, but not as effective, you know, you just need to test out. It's all about testing out. And if they say yes, um, opt them into your case study ebook, whether you want to give them for free, make sure it's really good and hopefully they can go and implement it. And then once they come back and it works, that's when you can, you know, maybe sell them on something. Um, and yeah, just always want to leave, you know, my videos with, with this saying, you know, the work doesn't care about you. Get it done regardless how you feel to see results. Make sure you actually go and implement all of this you know, because you're not going to receive results if you don't. See you in the next video, guys.